They're the biggest stars of the greatest show on earth. And when the spotlights are shining, these amazing animals know exactly how to thrill an audience. But when their circus days are over, these elephants head to their permanent home. The Ringling Brothers and Barnum and Bailey Center for Elephant Conservation. Built for the retirement, reproduction, and research of these amazing animals. These animals, they live anywhere between 40 and 65 years. So it is a lifetime commitment for every elephant, and it is a commitment that goes far deeper than just our company. The center, established in 1995 as a home base for Ringling Brothers elephants, is located in Central Florida. There, the largest herd of Asian elephants in the Western Hemisphere has plenty of room to roam. The center covers over 200 acres of pristine habitat. The herd includes young elephants growing up, retirees, and many animals that just didn't take a shine to circus life. About 30 elephants in all. Most of the elephants never travel and perform with the circus. If it's not their thing, if they're not comfortable with that, then they stay and live here throughout their lifetime, and they receive the best of care throughout their lifetime. A typical day at the center with these highly intelligent animals can be anything but typical. A team of over a dozen staff members cares for the herd. Working with these elephants on a daily basis is such a high caliber thrill, but there's also that daily sense of wonder of, of looking at one of the most magnificent creatures on the face of the earth. All the elephants form a bond with their caretakers. They socialize, spend time outdoors, and take a daily bath. And then there's eating, lots of eating. The menu here features two and a half tons of hay every day, plus up to 800 pounds of fruit, vegetables, and grains. That's not counting special elephant treats, like delicious grasses and willow branches. But the center is more than just a home. Having so many pachyderms in one place gives scientists a unique ability to study the species and learn how to improve their health. And we share that knowledge with scientists around the world, most recently as part of our conservation partnership with the island nation of Sri Lanka. They're so well trained that scientists that have never been up near, up close to elephants in any other way can get up close to our elephants and learn so much about this species that is unknown before. One place that the center is making strides is in helping the species continue. Elephant reproduction can be tricky. Before giving birth, females carry their young for a whopping 22 months, the longest pregnancy of any mammal. But despite the odds, more than two dozen baby elephants have taken their first steps here on Florida soil. Someday, what the staff is learning here could help save the endangered Asian elephant in the wild. The most exciting thing always at the center is when there's a new birth. Every elephant born represents a real movement in the right direction towards saving this species. It's a nursery for a new generation of elephants. It's a home where animals can grow up and grow old. And it's a place like none other in the Western Hemisphere, where a thriving herd of Asian elephants are studied in a natural habitat. At the Center for Elephant Conservation, we're fighting to save the endangered Asian elephant, one step at a time. There's no other place like this in the world. It's totally unique. It's totally all about and for the Asian elephant, and it's a major contribution to keeping this species alive on the Earth.